Welcome back folks, it's your boy, Editor Matt. I briefly mentioned in another video, so my monitor isn't very good for color grading, so I actually have my iPad connected to Premiere so I can see the colors there. This is because my monitor is for gaming and the colors are pretty garbage. Ooh. So if you're like me and you have a gaming monitor but you still wanna get good color in your videos, this video is for you. Now I should mention, I know my iPad's not gonna give me the best colors, but at least it'll be an accurate representation of what a user would see on YouTube. I should also mention that this works for iPhones, iPads, uh, tablets, I think all Android phones and tablets as well. This is very cross compatible to anything. So the app does cost $10 and it has the option to upgrade to a pro version and the Air version, but we're just gonna stick with the base $10 version. Now, if you have a new MacBook Pro and uh, iPad Pro, you can just use the sidecar feature to do this, but then again, why are you watching this video? Because you're editing on a MacBook Pro and you have a Retina display and that's kind of defeats the purpose of this whole video. So this method should work with any professional video editing software, uh, anything from Premiere Pro, DaVinci, I'm sure Final Cut's got this. Uh, you might It might not work on something like iMovie, Movie Maker, any editing software that allows you to use your external display as your output device. With all that being said, let's jump into this. I'm going to show you the app and how to set it up. So the app is called Duet Display. You can hop into the App Store or if you're on Android, you can go to the Google Play Store and download that. And the next thing you want to do is download the software. So if you're on PC, we're going to click this button. And if we're on Mac, we're going to hit this button. So once we have this installed, it's super easy. Just make sure that it is running and we're going to plug in our phone using our cord. And when we open the app, it should automatically detect your screen. So here in our duet settings, I just use 30 frames per second because all my footage is 24 frames per second. So we don't want any more than that. I use pixel perfect to get the best image quality out of my iPad. And for resolution, I just go somewhere in the middle so I don't get too much latency on my input. So as we can see, this is now running as a second monitor. I can click and do anything just as if it was a second display. But uh, what we want to actually do is in Premiere, set this display as our output device. So let me show you how to do that real quick. So in Premiere here, we just wanna to go to Edit, Preferences, and Playback. And then we wanna enable the Adobe Monitor 2 and hit OK. And there we have our image in Premiere. It, uh, it plays back pretty smooth, but if we're just using it for color grading, uh, it doesn't really matter too much. Uh, we just want to be able to see our colors. So now I know on camera you can probably barely see what I'm doing here, uh, but in person the color on the iPad is much better than my gaming monitor. So it's easy as that. That's it for this video. I hope this helps you. Hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and have yourself a wonderful day.